All right, fifth grade, um, happy Tuesday. Today what we will do is we will um, write our rough draft introduction paragraph. Okay, so we're talking about our narrative essays. We've been talking about them for a week now, a little over a week. Um, we talked about our hooks yesterday. Today we are going to write our introduction. Okay, this paragraph is going to have three, or excuse me, this essay is going to have three paragraphs. Um, your introduction will be just your first paragraph of this essay. Okay, so we're going to write that today. All right, so in order to do this assignment for today, make sure there's two things that I need you to have open. If you go to Monday, December 7th, this hooks assignment, have that open. Okay, and then also scroll down just a little bit farther to Friday, December 4th. If you have that open too for narrative plot diagram, you are good to go. Okay. So, um, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back just a little bit in time here. Make sure I get everything ready to go. All right. So, here we are for today's assignment. Okay. So, for our introduction, here is what is going to be inside of your introduction. Okay, we'll get on to this next slide here. Um, it's going to have four things. It's going to have your hook, it's going to have your exposition, and it's going to have your rising action one and two. Okay, now that is not anything that we have not done yet. Okay, we have already done the hard work on this. We are just going to put it into paragraph form. All right, so. If I go to yesterday's work, and if I go and I down I go to way down here to the bottom of the page, here is my. Um, actually, I think that I had a different one here. There it is. Okay, so here is my hook that I decided that I am going to do. Okay, um, if you have not done your hook yet, if you have not done Monday's assignment, then I want you to pause right now. I want you to go back and do that first. Okay, so um, if I go back and I look at today's assignment, the first thing that I'm going to put for my introduction is the hook. Okay, so um, here's what I would do. I'm going to copy. I'm going to paste this. So this last slide here, slide number three, this is where my introduction is going to go. Okay, so when it's time for me to start typing, I'm going to push tab. Because whenever we do a new paragraph, we need to make sure that we indent. Okay, I already copied this, so I'm going to paste it. Here is my first sentence of my narrative essay. Okay, the first sentence of my introduction. Hey, Jack, I have something to tell you and your cousins, said Mom. All right. So, now the next thing that we are going to do is we're going to do the exposition. Now, the exposition is something else that we already have done. Um, it is something that we did on Friday. So if I go to narrative plot diagram, okay, I go back in time a little bit to see when I made my edits. Okay, here we go. So um, here is the exposition. It's always the first thing that we do in a plot diagram. Okay, so with my exposition that I'm going to type today, you will do the exact same thing as me. All right, so this is my exposition. I talked about the setting and the characters. I said it happened in Sioux Falls, May 2006, and it was me, my grandma, and my family. Okay, so I'm going to go back. We're going to type our exposition here. The date was May. 2006 and I was with my grandma and my family okay there is my exposition if you remember the exposition of an essay is when we talk about the setting where it happened and when and then also who was there who were the characters okay so I talked about when this happened and I talked about who was there it was me, I, was with my grandma and my family. Okay, 
Now, we go back to this slide up here. The next thing that we're going to write is our rising action number one. So I'm going to go back up here to our plot diagram. So rising action number one, my grandma was very sick. She was in the hospital with cancer. The doctors were afraid that she would not survive. That's what I'm going to put for my rising action number one. Okay, that's also going to go into my introduction. Okay, so my grandma was in the hospital. And the doctors were afraid she would not survive. Okay, so there's my rising action number one. Now, the last sentence of our introduction, we're already on the last sentence, we'll do rising action number two. So I'll go back to my narrative plot diagram. Here is rising action number two. Since it was not looking good, my entire family came to visit her. So we'll go back. Since it was not looking like she would survive, my whole family came to visit her. Okay, so there is my introduction for my narrative essay. Okay, now this is a rough draft. We're doing a lot of extra work in our essay in the next coming days and weeks even. Um, but right now, this is our rough draft for our narrative essay. Okay, I do want to go through really quick and I want to show you this first sentence here is our hook. So let's highlight this here in oh, say yellow. Okay, so here's our hook. All right, hook is hey Jack, I have something to tell you and your cousin, said mom. And we found that information under our hook activity from yesterday. All right, then we did um, our exposition. Let's highlight this green. Okay, I don't want you to do this. This is for um, you to kind of see where we're finding all of our information. So our exposition is this next sentence here. That green. Okay, and where we found our exposition is under narrative plot diagram from Friday, December fourth, and that is our exposition down here in the bottom right. How we kind of set up our story. All right, then we have rising action number one. I will highlight this in red. And again, you do not have to do all this highlighting. That is for me to show you where to find everything. Okay. So here we are in red. So here's rising action number one. And I found that information on the plot diagram that we did on Friday. Okay. So here's my rising action number one. And then we have rising action number two for today, and I'll do blue. Okay. And that's this last sentence here. And where I found that was also under narrative plot diagram from Friday, and here's rising action number two. Okay, now we are not done with this narrative plot diagram. That's why I said it was so important on Friday, because everything that we have wrote on Friday is going to go into our story. Yes, we have not talked about rising action number three. We have not talked about the climax. We have not talked about falling action number one, two, or three, or what we learned. Okay, we have not done those yet. We will do those in the next coming days. We're going to put them into a rough draft. I'm going to tell you where they go. Um, and then we'll edit them from there. Okay, so this plot diagram, it's very important that you make sure that you have it all done, ready to go. Um, if you are somebody who is like, um, I might want to go back and redo some things, you can always go back up here to this um, video that I posted if you want to go back and make sure that everything looks good. Okay, that's going to be very important. All right, so um, that is the introduction for our narrative essay. So here it is. Um, yours will not be highlighted, of course. Okay. Um, this is our introduction. We will go from there. Make sure that your introduction is done for today. And then we'll go on to our body paragraph tomorrow on Wednesday. All right. Remember, 10 a.m. every single day, I am available for office hours. If you have any questions, please let me know.